Okay, what I don't get is so many YouTubers are lying. Look. Watch this video. They seem innocent, but he's not. It's time to reveal the dark truth. You see, if you go to his channel, you'll see a video where he built an indoor play area for his kids. Oh, so nice, so innocent. For the next video along, I saved a sheep's <laughs> life. This video is a lie! In this video, Dan claims that he found sheep laying on their back that if he didn't save, they would die. Oh no, so Dan goes to save them. It seems fine at first. Right? But notice the fear in the sheep's eyes as Dan walks to them. All three of the sheep he save, they don't look happy to be being rescued. I have done some calculating. Do sheep run when they're saved? No. And I've realized Dan pushed these sheep over so he could rescue them and film it for views. He claims there's no way he could find them like this. And that's because he didn't find them like that. He made them like that. Dan has been letting sheep suffer for his own monetary gain. Now subscribe to me because I say the truth about how Dan Tiddy... And then look at this one. I was just minding my own business, watching some YouTube shorts, and this popped up. Dan Tiddy and may seem innocent, but he's not. What the? Dan pushed these sheep over so he could rescue them and film it for views. <laughs> Tommy, Tommy, Tommy. It's about time this kid respected his elders. First time we met, you threw me off a crane. Oh, oh my God. Dad! Second time we met, he puts me in a straitjacket on stage and his freaky puppet kills me. He's also using my face in his live show without my permission. And now he's accusing me of pushing sheep over for views? I don't believe this. He's accusing family friendly, no controversies, Dan TDM of such a YouTube crime? You know what? Everyone should be subscribing to me as an apology for listening to him. How dare he? Ah. dinner bone so i can't tell who's lying and then look and then this one looks at life one of my favorite youtubers just turned on me he made a video literally bullying and the video got eight million views what the hell look at this this youtuber thinks he could steal my guinness world record <laughs> sent all of his crazed fans to hate on me just because i have more play That they have taken over my comment section. Things are looking rough, but now it's time to get real. I used to be one of your biggest fans. I literally joined a call with you three years ago when I had 3,000 subscribers. But I have 14 million now. After I blew up, you have clickbaited me over and over again. You've taken it too far. I'm going to expose you now, Jack. You ready? He's literally my biggest fan. I just did a live show and he paid money to go and see it. He's a star. And then he tracked me down and insisted to recreate a photo we took four years ago. Subscribe if you're on my side. And that's why this YouTube... And then, look at this. Tommy Inner just released this YouTube short where he exposes me? No, I didn't see this horrible short straight away. Why? Because I was celebrating my birthday. Who makes a hate video about someone on their birthday? And what was I wearing during my birthday meal? My favourite Tommy Inner merch. Not only is Tommy lying about this, just because I have more play buttons than him, but he also said this. I'm going to expose you now, Jack. He's literally my biggest fan. I just did a live show and he paid money to go and see it. He's a stalker. Tommy is lying. Again, he literally begged me to come and he even gave me a free ticket. Price zero. I have the proof right here. Tommy then secretly filmed us when we shared what I thought was a personal moment. This guy's a psycho. Subscribe if you're on my side because this YouTuber is lying about I me. I just can't tell who's winning. Um, comment down below or if the comments don't work, I don't know. Um, but they should be able to work, I'm not sure. Um, so yeah. Um, yeah. I'm Tommy Inner just released this Unsubscribe to Tommy in it, because I think he is a liar. Peace out, guys.